Meet John. He likes to multitask with his BlackBerry, running several memory-intensive applications at the same time. He would check his email, surf the internet, send text messages, search the map for hard-to-find restaurants, organize his tasks, play games, take photos of his friends, watch videos, and use enterprise applications. Gosh, John sure is quite the multitasker. All of these applications slow down his BlackBerry, because they not only take up memory in its SD card, but also the working memory of his BlackBerry, commonly referred to as RAM, which is temporarily used when applications are running. Yet John doesn't want to use fewer applications, he simply wants to use them more efficiently. Therefore, he needs something that boosts the performance of the RAM in his BlackBerry. This is Memory Booster, in plain English. Imagine the memory in a BlackBerry as a box with a limited amount of space. In order for applications to run, they need to temporarily create little helpers, what are known as objects, that take up a certain amount of memory, like cubes taking up space inside a box. However, when applications are running in the background, they continue to take up the same amount of memory. For example, when John first opens the mail application to read his emails, but then clicks on a link and is now surfing the internet, mail continues to run in the background and takes up the same amount of memory, even though he's not using it. In other words, when John leaves an application, it doesn't necessarily mean it's entirely closed. So if, after surfing the internet, John decides to play a game, which by nature is very memory intensive, the memory in John's BlackBerry will become pretty full, and his BlackBerry will run out of memory soon. This is because there are still these temporary objects from applications that have completed their job but continue to take up memory. These objects are waiting to be cleared by the garbage collector in John's BlackBerry, which is designed to run automatically by itself. However, John has no control over when and how efficiently to get rid of these unneeded objects in the memory of his BlackBerry. With Memory Booster, John can instantly and manually clean up the memory in his BlackBerry whenever and wherever he wants. He just needs to open the menu and click on Boost Memory. As a result, his BlackBerry responds much faster immediately after performing the boost. Alternatively, John can set Memory Booster to automatically clean up the memory in his BlackBerry, in two ways. He can designate a time, say every five minutes, for cleaning, and he can designate when to activate Memory Booster based on the amount of free memory that's available. For example, when free memory drops below 30%, Memory Booster will automatically clean up the memory. Memory Booster also comes with automatic boosting presets, where John can choose between high performance or battery preservation. These presets configure the automatic and optimal memory boosting setup, so that John doesn't have to worry about whether he has the best settings possible. What's more, Memory Booster keeps track of its memory boosting activity in the form of a log so that John can see how effectively Memory Booster optimizes the memory on his BlackBerry. John's BlackBerry now runs much faster with the help of Memory Booster. It boosts memory and therefore improves productivity. Applications run much faster and more smoothly. Memory Booster can track its memory boosting efficiency, and John can run Memory Booster on its own in the background without having to check it constantly. Best of all, John can run many applications at the same time. This has been Memory Booster in plain English. Get yours now at s4bb.com.